Good day viewers and thank you most sincerely for tuning in to Polymer Update TV, the world's first TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the Petrochemical Market Synopsis with me, Jake Wong. It is Friday, December 22nd. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices fell on Thursday on reports that Angola, the second largest oil producing country in Africa, is set to exit the Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries Alliance. The fall in prices was also the result of a rise in fuel inventories in the United States. Brent crude prices fell by 0.31 cents settling at $79.39 per barrel, while WTI futures decreased by 0.33 cents settling at $73.89 per barrel. On Thursday, open spec naphtha prices fell by $8 per metric ton at $701 per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. This week, PP prices down adjusted in Europe owing to excess supply of ales in the market. The situation has further been exacerbated by the upcoming Christmas holidays, typically considered a lean demand season when converters wind down their operations. Meanwhile, market players have been particularly focused on fulfilling their contractual obligations as the year draws to a close. In the spot markets, PP injection molding grade prices were assessed at the 985 to 995 euros per metric ton FD Northwest Europe mark and PP block copolymer grade prices were assessed at the 1,065 to 1,095 euros per metric ton FD Northwest Europe levels, both week-on-week -week declined by 30 euros per metric ton. This week, PVC spot prices dropped in Europe. This week, polypropylene export prices rolled over in the United States. This week, polyvinyl chloride export prices quoted flat in the United States. If you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to our free news channel and like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you our free news service on a daily basis. In plant news, Sinopec Anching Petrochemical is likely to shut down its polypropylene unit for maintenance in early August 2024. Further details on the duration of the shutdown could not be ascertained. Located in Anching, China, the PP unit has a production capacity of 300,000 metric ton per year. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video on Tuesday to know more. This is Polymer Update, with me Jake Wong, from Polymer Update's Virtual World. Many thanks for watching.